Chapter 19 The Territory Assigned to Simeon The second assignment made was for the families of the tribe of Simeon. Its territory extended into the land assigned to the tribe of Judah. It included Beersheba, Sheba, Mulada, Hazar Shual, Bala, Ezem, Eltalad, Bethol, Horma, Ziklag, Beth Markaboth, Hazar Susa, Beth Labaoth, and Sharuhen, thirteen cities along with the towns around them. There were also Ain, Ramon, Ether, and Ashan, four cities along with the towns around them. This included all the towns around these cities as far as Baalath Beer or Rama in the south. This was the land which the families of the tribe of Simeon received as their possession. Since Judah's assignment was larger than was needed, part of its territory was given to the tribe of Simeon. The Territory Assigned to Zebulun The third assignment made was for the families of the tribe of Zebulun. The land which they received reached as far as Sarad. From there the border went west to Mareel touching Dabasheth, and the stream east of Jokneum. On the other side of Sarad, it went east to the border of Chishloth Tabor, then to Dabaroth, and up to Japhia. It continued east from there to gath and Ethkazan, turning in the direction of Nia on the way to Ramon. On the north, the border turned toward Hanathon, ending at Iphthalal Valley. It included Kathath, Nahalal, Shimron, Adalah, and Bethlehem, twelve cities along with the towns around them. These cities and their towns were in the land which the families of the tribe of Zebulun received as their possession. The territory assigned to Ishakar. The fourth assignment made was for the families of the tribe of Ishakar. Its area included Jezreel, Cheseloth, Shunem, Hafariam, Shion, Anaharath, Rabith, Kishion, Ebez, Remeth, and Ganim, Enhada, and Beth Pezez. The border also touched Tabor, Shahazuma, and Beth Shemesh, ending at the Jordan. It included sixteen cities, along with the towns around them. These cities and their towns were in the land which the families of the tribe of Ishakar received as their possession. The Territory Assigned to Asher The fifth assignment made was for the families of the tribe of Asher. Its area included Helkath, Hali, Betan, Akshaf, Alam Melech, Ahmad, and Mashal. On the west it touched Carmel, and Shahor Libnath. As it turned east, the border went to Bethdagon, touching Zebulun and Iphthalo Valley, on the way north to Bethmech and Neil. It continued north to Kabul, Ebron, Rahab, Hammon, and Cana, as far as Sidon. The border then turned to Ramah, reaching the fortified city of Tyre. Then it turned to Hosa and ended at the Mediterranean Sea. It included Mahalab, Achzib, Uma, Afek, and Rehob, 22 cities, along with the towns around them. These cities and their towns were in the land which the families of the tribe of Asher received as their possession. The Territory Assigned to Naphtali The sixth assignment made was for the families of the tribe of Naphtali. Its border went from Heleph to the oak in Zananim, on to Aminakeb and Chajamnia, as far as Lakum, and ended at the Jordan. There the border turned west to Asnoth Tabor, from there to Hukok, touching Zebulun on the south, Asher on the west, and the Jordan on the east. The fortified cities were Zedim, Zer, Hamath, Rakath, Shinareth, Adama, Rama, Hazor, Kadesh, Adrai, and Hazor, 
Yaron, Magdelo, Horam, Bethanath, and Beth Shemesh, nineteen cities along with the towns around them. These cities and their towns were in the land which the families of the tribe of Naphtali received as their possession. The territory assigned to Dan. The seventh assignment made was for the families of the tribe of Dan. Its area included Zora, Eshtal, Urshemesh, Shalbim, Ajalon, Ethla, Elon, Timna, Ekron, Eltika, Gibbethon, Baalath, Jehud, Benabarak, Gathramon, Mejarkon, and Rakon, as well as the territory around Joppa. When the people of Dan lost their land, they went to Laish and attacked it. They captured it, killed its people, and claimed it for themselves. They settled there and changed the name of the city from Laish to Dan, naming it after their ancestor, Dan. These cities and their towns were in the land which the families of the tribe of Dan received as their possession. The Final Assignment of the Land When the people of Israel finished dividing up the land, they gave Joshua, son of Nun, a part of the land as his own. As the Lord had commanded, they gave him the city he asked for, Timnath Sarah, in the hill country of Ephraim. He rebuilt the city and settled there. Eleazar, the priest, Joshua, son of Nun, and the leaders of the families of the tribes of Israel assigned these parts of the land by drawing lots to consult the Lord at Shiloh, at the entrance of the tent of the Lord's presence. In this way they finished dividing the land.